Hi everybody, I'm Pepe Ramirez. Actually, I have this ring seat ties for two. Uh, it's the year of 2009, and also that's the year of Lady Gaga, the new era for her. And I first saw her on television, of course. Um, I saw her wearing a really, really crazy clothing, and I feel like it's wow. This woman are crazy. This woman is crazy. This woman is gorgeous. She looks really great and sophisticated, empowered. And I think women should be this way. In, I, I guess in Hong Kong, because most of the girls were so casual, I don't find fashion is really, really that great. I, can't, I, I don't feel like it's really a big deal for people. But gradually, I found that it's really making a people make, making people beautiful, making what's beautiful. Um, then I started to search for designers like me. Then I figure out who is Alexander McQueen, and then who is Jean Paul Gaultier, and I don't know who is Karl Lagerfeld, uh, what Shabon she is, what Balenciaga, and I finally got them. And Alexander McQueen to me is really inspiring because he's the one to make me want to be a fashion designer. And I first saw his fashion show on social media like YouTube. And they are, I mean, models wearing his clothes are really great. And and they're wearable, but they call showpiece, sophisticated, gorgeous avant-garde. And gradually I started to design my clothes, I started to draw my own outfits, and I started to make my own clothes the first time when I was born to having a fashion show at school. And it's really a great experience, and I'm, I, I can still remember the time I've made, I made a uh, really stunning silver pants for my models and she looks really gorgeous and, and I learned drawing I didn't learn but I started practice drawing and I start to draw my outfits more clear I guess and more um, I guess realistic and I started um, to create my own, you know, collection, 
I guess. Just drawing. But I really feel great to my dream because it's seldom for me to have some kind of dream, like so called dream, that I can maintain for such a long time. It's a few years thing. Usually I have only a few months. Few months enjoyment on my so called interests. So to me fashion is some kind of really, really important stuff. Important stuff. Important thing. That to me is really, really great. And to me is really, really a thing and a matter. And that's some kind of selfish but it's really for me and for my whole life for I guess for almost 60 to 70 years later. So I feel really great. That's why I would like to be a fashion designer. To me why this video is up here it's really really because of what I'm going to say now. I have decided to have my own fashion show after my examination. Uh, after the diploma level examination. And this is my dream to have one. And also this is my, that's actually a kind of experience for me. And I really, really like it. And I really, really would like to do all kind of this. And this is a huge risk for me. And like in a in a film, there is a quotation which says, Life is about going into the unknown. And and I can tell that I am now going to the unknown by taking a risk of not having anything but my dream, but my team to back me up and and they are really good and that um, they are helping me planning the, all the show, the whole thing. And we have already done deal with the paper design, this drawing. And we're now going to have some, some kind of help from others because we, you know, teenagers have little capitals, but we want to have it to be big. And I would like it to be wow. Although I don't have really sophisticated, great tailoring skills. However, I, I just want people to look at my designs and people to look at the things that I'm, that I'm doing, that I'm making. And for other things is that I really, really would like to have people to sponsor us because um, we're really in need and we're we do really need some help in capital. Although sometimes you may not have a lot or you may not, you can't help us in money stuff, but, um, uh, or you can send a, an email or you give us a like on Facebook, Instagram, um, Twitter, and, or even send us an email and to tell us where you're supporting us, that's really good and that's fine. And we would like to say that uh, in our sponsorship, um, like kind of commitment agreement, uh, we're going to have uh, ex an exclusive uh, ready to wear collection for the highest fashion finder in our sponsorship. And let's say if some kind of brick band, brick big brands in Hong Kong, I'm sorry, big brands in Hong Kong, um, we would like to give it a try to sell a collection in the store and so that everybody can buy our design and that will be our plan and that will be what we're now going to do. We hope you will support us and I hope um, some kind of firm or some kind of fashion brands or some kind of fashion corporations will be interested and will announce all the information, latest information on Twitter, Facebook or Instagram. And 
hope you can just um, give us a like to let us know that you know what is happening. And just give us support and we're really so honored to have your help or even have you supporting us. And that's really what I would like to say. And I wish you all good. And now it's kind of new days for for us on Earth. So on Earth. So um, I wish you all good. And I wish you all have a better life and have a happy life that you would like to have. And the last thing that I would like to tell is the show may not be. Um, I guess we're not sure that the show will be successfully. You know, been helped. So we can just tell that there may be a show for us. If there, no matter how, we'll tell you all whether the show is going to be held and when, where the show will be going to help if it is successful on different media. So thank you for you all watching and thank you for your support. Bye. Bye-bye.